so um i did a remix to crocodile teeth a water touching oh the trendy dance all subscribe So first things first is that um, this is the 12 year anniversary of Beam Me Up Scotty Mixtape and a lot of you have been with me for so freaking long. Repping me, holding me down when I'm not around, y'all be going hard for me, love you to death. Um, so because this is the 12 year anniversary, we thought that we would do something special. Um, I have never ever in life put my mixtapes on streaming services I, you know a lot of people have done that and I've never done it so what we're doing tonight is we are putting beaming up Scotty for the first time ever on streaming services there might be like two or three songs that didn't make the cut for, for whatever reason um, but but yeah so for the most part the whole the whole tape is gonna be on streaming services now for you guys I wonder what's your what was y'all favorite Be Me Up Scotty song? Cause I was real I was recently listening to it and you know what I can't stop playing? I can't stop playing Envy and I can't stop playing Best I Ever Had and I can't stop playing Go Hard. Um Of course Itty Bitty Piggy, uh Slumber Party, um, Gia. So those were did you have a favorite? All of them are favorite. You can't pick one. Chat Um, okay. Well, those were my favorite. I was listening to them recently. Um, so so shout out to you know, DJ Holiday. <clears throat> he he did my tape back then. Um, shout out to Deb, uh Gucci Man, the whole Atlanta that was repping me at that time. Thank you guys. Um, um and and yeah, so a lot of people showed me love on that tape, which I'm very happy about. Of course, Dwayne Carter is on there. He showed me lots of love. Um, um, Drake, love you too, Def Drake. Thank you for showing me love on that. I don't know who else was on it, but anyway. So having said that, um, who? So so because I I knew if I would just re-release the mixtape without putting out anything new, I knew y'all would like you know cuss me the fuck out. So what I did was. I did a couple new joints for the mixtape. Um, so it's so it's not. I know y'all was asking me where's the cover art and this and that and this number one. This ain't no TikTok shit. This ain't no TikTok thing. You understand? So. I appreciate you guys for caring about that, but this is just to get back to the basics a little bit, um, to the essence of why I started rapping. Um, I started rapping because I love listening to people that, that, you know, spit, like I love punchlines. That was always like my, like my favorite thing and, and always made people like my favorite artists because of that. <laughs> Um, so, I'm sorry, y'all, that my nose is running. Um, so, we wanted to add a couple other things to get you guys, um, to get you guys excited about the re-release re of the mixtape. And so, what I did was, I added a couple joints. So, um, I did a remix to crocodile teeth and then i did a record called um fractions on an old j beat and i did another song this is actually on an original beat but um but it's you know in the freestyle vibe it's still you know free freestyle type type thing so so that's all in preparation of, you know, of course, I'm working on the album for you guys. Um, hi, Ali Berry. <laughs> um, I'm working for the album 
um, I just, I might have uh, looked upon a couple new little, little things for the album yesterday, too. So, the album is coming soon. The documentary is as well. I'm really excited for you guys to see the documentary. I know you're going to love it. Hi, Beanie Man. I love you. Um, but, but no, you guys, I didn't want you to be thinking about this as some, oh my God, we got to you know, this is Nikki's lead single. No, to answer your questions, because I saw a lot of you guys asking that on Twitter. It's not. Um, but it is very, very important. So, a couple things. Hi, Ming Lee. Okay, hi, Courtney. A couple things. Um, Papa Bear is doing great. I love Papa Bear. Yesterday, Papa Bear said, I mean, two, two, two days ago, he said, Mama. I'm so funny. <laughs> he said, Mama. And I happened to be recording him. I was like, say it. And he kept on saying, Mama, Mama. And he was like yelling at me because I didn't realize he was saying it a bunch of times until I went back and played the, the video. And I said, oh, I see why my little uh, baby was yelling at me because Mama wasn't hearing him saying Mama all them times. And yes, so he said, Mama, I might put that out because it's so cute. But then on the other hand, I, 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 on the other hand, it's, you know, it's, it's like my baby. And I don't know yet. I'm so overprotective. I'm, you know, a mama bear. Um, but, but, um, so so those are the three joints if you if you are on my mailing list i did a really dope little letter for you guys that you will get you will get a letter from me it's going over a few things that just went down in the last few months for me um as always i have to tell you guys that i fucking love you so much um hi tama um because you always make me feel happy um, even when I stay away for a long time, you always make me feel happy. This little hiatus was really fun because I was, you know, in mommy mode, but also I went through like this crazy little writer's block for a second. And it, if you are an artist, no matter what you do, like you know how crazy it is when all of a sudden like you can't really flex your art the way you used to so i did go through a little bit of writer's block and i was like bam and then all of a sudden um i got you know what i hit drake and i asked him i was like yo i'm doing this mixtape who got who got the hottest shit out right now who should i jump on blah 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 and he was like here so he sent me something so that's one of the things that you will hear tonight it's called seeing green um that was drake sent it to me and asked me to get on oh it's, oh you got the nerve to be on my live drake you better call me right the fuck now it's going down the goat is on the motherfucking line what's up the goat oh i'm sorry y'all can you see my snot coming down no but you need to take it Y'all, yeah. my snot is coming down because right before I got on live, I got a really, a really beautiful surprise that I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to tell you guys about it, but it was so sweet. I just couldn't stop crying. So after I did my makeup, I had to redo a little bit under my eyes and my nose because someone that I fucking love so much um sent me the most sentimental meaningful beautiful thing card and flowers and stuff like that but when i read the card i just i it made me super super emotional but um so how can i call champagne poppy because he getting one this live Y'all tell me how to do it. I don't know how to do it. Y'all know I'm dumb. You gotta find his name. You gotta find his name. Tell him to write something. 
Mm-hmm. He probably gonna hide now. He like, bitch, I ain't say all of that now. <laughs> Where he at? He gotta write something and we hit his name. And they told me not to do it like this too, but I wasn't planning on adding anybody. Drake, type because I'm adding you. You can't run away. You've already shown yourself. And it's it's moving. It's so many people that I can't even pinpoint it. And this this happened. This always happened, child. Yeah, it's a lie. He's not even.